Lecture 10, Part 3. Uh, let's continue. Theory of composites, uh, strength properties. Uh, this theory enables us to calculate the value of Young's modulus for our composite. Uh, and uh, to tailor the resultant stiffness exactly to our requirements, uh, if we need to do so. For this calculation, we shall need to know matrix stiffness, fiber of uh, or reinforcement stiffness, volume fraction of matrix, and volume fraction of reinforcement. In a simple fiber matrix system, if we know the volume fraction of fibers, uh, the volume fraction of matrix will simply be given by 1 minus fraction, uh, the volume fraction of um, fibers. The theory enables us to calculate the composite stiffness parallel to the fiber direction and transverse, as it is 90 degrees to the fiber direction. Uh, here you can see, a, um, for your understanding, what is the transverse direction and a longitudinal direction. Example 1. Uh, parallel to, fi uh, to the fiber direction, the stiffness of the composite with uh, matrix reinforced by continuous uh, unidirectional fibers in the direction of the fibers is given by um, the stiffness of the composite equals um, fiber or reinforcement stiffness multiply volume fraction of reinforcement plus matrix stiffness multiply volume fraction of matrix. This equation is referred to in some textbooks as the ruler of mixtures and in others as the void equation. Worked, uh, worked in the example. Calculate the value of Young's modulus in the fiber direction for a glass reinforced polymer composite where the fibers are unidirectionally aligned given that the volume fraction of fibers is 40%. The values of Young's modulus for glass fiber and plastic matrix are 80 gigapascal and 0 0.2 gigapascal respectively. So, matrix stiffness equals 0 0.2 gigapascal, fiber stiffness equals 80 gigapascal, volume fraction of matrix equals 0 0.6, volume fraction of fibers equals 0 0.4. Use the void equation. We uh, can calculate um, Young's modulus for our composite Z equals 32.012 Giga Pascal. Example 2 Transfers 
to the fiber direction, the stiffness of the composite uh, in the transverse direction to the fiber is given by uh, the next equation. A Young's modulus uh, for our composite equals matrix stiffness multiply fiber or reinforcement stiffness divide by fiber or reinforcement stiffness multiply volume fraction of matrix plus matrix stiffness multiply volume fraction of reinforcement. In some older textbooks this is sometimes called the Rails equation. Worked example. Calculate the value of Young's modulus stiffness for the uh, GRP given above for the transverse direction to fiber alignment. Take the same values for stiffness and volume fraction in each case. So matrix stiffness, uh, we know fiber stiffness and uh, uh, we know volume fraction of matrix and volume fraction of fiber. Using the Rayos equation, we can calculate Young's modulus for our composite Z um, equals 0 0.333 gigapascal. Example 3. Density composites. Densities are calculated using a version of the ruler of mixture. Thus, density of composite equals density of fibers multiply volume fraction of fiber plus density of matrix multiply volume fraction of matrix. What example? We have a glass reinforced polymer with a fiber volume fraction of 40%. The respective density of fiber and matrix are 2600 kilograms divided by um, cubic meters and uh, uh, 1,400 kilograms divided by cubic meters. Calculate the density of the resulting composite. So matrix density. We know fibers density also. We know volume fraction of matrix and volume fraction of fiber. So, using the equation above, overall density of composites we can calculate and uh, these uh, characteristics equals 1880 kilograms divided by cubic meters. Therefore, the overall density of the resulting composite will be 1880 kilogram divided by cubic meter. Theory of composites. Second, thermal properties. We need to know the thermal conductivity values for the materials in the structure. We also need to know the thickness of the layer of material. The thermal resistivity of a material. Uh, 
Thermal resistivity equals 1 divided by K, where K, this is a thermal conductivity. The thermal resistance of a layer of material can be calculated using the following expression. Thermal resistance equals 1 divided by K multiply T and T, this is a thickness in meter. So, uh, here you can see a scheme of the wall with, uh, from polyurethane form and a concrete block. A worked example. Concrete blocks 100 mm thick are to be replaced with concrete polyurethane composite blocks. Also 100 mm thick to increase the thermal resistance of a building wall. The composite will consist of concrete 60 mm thick and uh, polyurethane form layer 40 mm thick. Calculate. First, the thermal resistance of concrete block and uh, second, the thermal mm, resistance uh, of the composite blocks. Thermal conductivity values are as follows. Mm, for concrete, 1.4. And for polyurethane form, uh, 0.08. So, um, we can calculate resistance of uh, concrete blocks um, by this uh, equation. And uh, this uh, equals uh, 0 0.071. And resistance of composites. Uh, also by this equation and uh, uh, first find resistance of uh, 60 mm of concrete. Uh, if we uh, take, uh, we can find the resistance of composite 0.043 meter uh, square meter um, K divide by W. And next resistance of polyurethane form. Uh, with um, form layer 40 millimeter, we can cal also calculate and the total thermal resistance of composite will be resistance of composite plus resistance of polyurethane and uh, total thermal resistance will be 0 0.543 uh, cubic uh, square meter uh, K divided by W. From this we can see that by adding the layer of polyurethane form, we have increased the thermal resistance of the 100 mm layer from 0.071 to 0.543. We have effectively increased the thermal resistance by our 7.6 times without increasing the wall thickness. Summary. Advantages and uh, disadvantages of composite materials. Advantages include weight reduction, approximately 20-50%. Uh, uh, Corrosion resistance, fatigue resistance, uh, tailorable mechanical properties, sales through the offset, lower assembly cost, further fasteners, etc. Disadvantages of composite materials are some 
higher recurring cost, higher non recurring cost, uh, higher materials cost, non visible impact damage. Repairs are different than those to metal structure. Isolation needed to prevent adjacent aluminium part galvanic corrosion. Summary. Composites are classified according to the matrix material. Uh, their reinforcement geometry, particles, fibers, and layers. Composites enhance matrix properties. Enhanced by summary. Composites are classified according to the matrix material. Um, keramic matrix composite, metal matrix composite, and polymer matrix composite. The reinforcement geometry, particles, fibers, layers. Composites enhance matrix properties for metal matrix composites enhance strength creep perform uh, performance tensile strength ceramic matrix composites enhance k uh, polymer matrix composites enhance uh, stiffness, matrix stiffness, strength, tensile strength, and creep performance. Particulate reinforced. Elastic modulus can be estimated. Properties are isotropic. Fiber reinforced. Elastic modulus and uh, tensile strength can be Estimated along fiber gyre. Properties can be isotropic or anisotropic. Structural. Based on build-up of sandwiches in a layered form. Thank you very much. And now a quick quiz. Give example. Uh, give examples of natural composite materials. Uh, you can find the answer for this question on clause 18.3. What are the common geometries of composite reinforcement? What is the best known composite materials in construction? This is uh, your homework. What are the requirements for successful reinforcement of the material with another? How to calculate the stiffness of composite? How to calculate the density of composite? And now uh, vocabulary. Composite materials. Fibers. Sheets, particles, matrix, fiberglass, glass reinforced plastic, Kevlar, Young's modulus. Timber. Hardwood, softwood, cell, seasoning, plywood, 
shipboard, kiln, distortion, decay, road, fungi, deterioration, polymer, monomer, plastic, thermosetting plastic, thermoplastic, epoxy, polyesters, polyurethane, polyvinyl chloride, polyethylene, composites, fiber reinforced plastic, concrete, cement, component, aggregate, hydration, kiln, gravel, fornace slug, expanded clay, fly ash, pumping, clinker, mixing, Placing Pot Furnace Tank Furnace Annealing Shaping Melting Amorphous Silicate, silicon, sodium, potassium, calcium, lead, zinc, lime, oxygen, excite, flint. Alloy, blast furnace, or corrosion, malleable, ductile, electrolysis, carbon, aluminium, brass, iron. Copper, steel, bonding, alloy, shear force, atom, neutron, proton, electron, stiffness. Elasticity, melting, fracture, creep, fatigue, crack, building materials, environment, concrete. Metal, steel, timber, insulation materials, polymers, clay, glass, gypsum, bitum, transparent, bendy, rigid. Soft, hard, 
liquefied. Bye.